Welcome to my outdoor kitchen in Country Pumpkin Land. Today we are cooking with the cob. Today we are making a shawarma tempeh kebab on the cob rotisserie. Let's cook. We're gonna make a delicious shawarma spice rub for the kebab. So we're going in with some cinnamon and some cumin, some ground ginger, some smoked paprika, some cayenne pepper. Next up, we are putting in some oregano and parsley, some turmeric, salt and pepper. This smells so good. Add a generous glug of olive oil. Add a fresh squeeze of lemon juice. This is tempeh, a traditional Indonesian food, usually made from soya beans, but today we are using black bean tempeh. Tempeh is made by fermenting the beans with a culture in a very controlled fermentation process. I have no idea how we're gonna do this without stabbing myself, but here goes. <laughs> tempeh is high in protein and packed with vitamins and minerals, including iron, magnesium, and calcium. Tempeh can also improve insulin resistance, promote bone health, and lower inflammation. Connect this little cool motor thing. It's going to go round and round and round. Super easy. Just plugs in like that and slips in over there. And then we press the button and magic happens. Voila! Before you baste your kebab, put the lid on so that the veggies can steam through first. And now we baste. Look at this deliciousness. Mm mm mm. I really love using the cob rotisserie for this dish and I can't wait to experiment with more vegetables and fruits too. This is looking so good, I think it's done. We're gonna switch our motor off and take this baby off. The cob is so versatile and easy to set up, use and clean. It's such a nifty cooking device and you get to cook anywhere but the kitchen. Yum yum. This is the perfect between season dish as it combines both cooked and raw food for a colourful, nutritious and delicious meal that is packed with plant power. Yum, yum, yum! Ha, 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 ha.